In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to make a talking NPC just like what is shown in the background. You can customize what it says and you can also respond to the NPC. So with that out of the way, let's start the video. Hey guys, welcome to On Fire Roblox Scripting and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a talking NPC. So the first thing you're actually going to need is an actual NPC. So there's this amazing uh, plugin by Already Pro. Or basically you can load in your own NPC so um, there will be a link in the description to that plugin once you get that plugin just press load character and then you can type in um, like an avatar's name so for example if I want to type in if I want my own avatar I can go goat sharpener and then I can spawn myself in so once I've spawned myself in I can drag him down to here so this will be our NPC, and you can name the NPC whatever you want. For example, if I want it to be called NPC, I can call it NPC. So next step we're going to do is open up uh, your character and scroll down until you find head. Once you find head, click the plus and then enter in a dialog. So once you got the dialog, you go into the properties. Oh, and also, by the way, if you don't have Explore and Properties open, they're under the View tab. Just make sure you get them opened. So once you go to the properties of the dialog, um, basically, you can customize uh, what the NPC says. For example, say the conversation distance is 25, and then the initial prompt. So there's going to be a question mark uh, above the NPC, and then this is what he'll say as soon as you touch it. So basically, let's for example say, hi, hello there. Okay, so now that we've got our initial prompt, or what happens when you talk to him, we're going to put it in use, and then if you want like a goodbye dialogue, just make sure that you add in a goodbye dialogue. Goodbye, hope to talk to you again. So after you've got your initial dialog, go under the dialog, click the plus, and enter in a dialog choice. So now you can respond to the NPC's initial dialog, and then it will respond back to you. So what you say towards the NPC is over here in user dialog. For example, you can write something like, Hello there! How much money is being donated to hashtag team sees this month okay so you might be a little bit confused on why i wrote that but basically for the month of november we got 11,716 views um and with my policy of every 1,000 views equals to one dollar donate to team sees which means we've donated eleven dollars and 72 cents to team sees uh, the video will be out soon, so be on the lookout for that. But anyways, that's why I wrote that, and back with the video. So after you got your user dialogue, you can have a response dialogue, so what the NPC can say. For example, you can say $11.72. And then you can say goodbye dialogue, for example, like goodbye. And then it doesn't have to be one choice, you can actually have multiple choices. So you can add in a second dialogue choice, just make sure that you know which is which. So I'm going to put a 2 behind the second one. And then the user dialogue can be something like, Hello there, you look funny. And then the NPC can be like, Bruh. And then the goodbye is like, Goodbye. And then you can just keep on going. You can like make a whole entire conversation with the NPC. You just have to keep on clicking the plus under dialogue choice with another dialogue choice. And then it can, and then like conversation will just keep on going down. So let's go quickly test it out. So I just loaded into the game. And this is where our NPC dialogue is. For example, if we're too far away, it will tell us. And then we can go here. It says, hi, hello there. And here we have three different choices. So we can say, hello, how much money is being donated this month? $11.72. And then since that's the end, we didn't add anything else, the conversation ends. 
and then we can talk to him again, like, hello there, you look funny. And then the NPC will just say, bruh. And then we have the goodbye option, so if we say hello there, and goodbye, and then the conversation ends. So that's how you make talking NPCs in Roblox Studio. If you found this helpful, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If it helped you in any way, consider watching other tutorials that might help you. Also consider subscribing, but only if you want to. But anyways, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye!